What is up, ladies and gentlemen? एक बार फिर से आपका स्वागत है हमारे एक और धमाकेदार एपिसोड में और आज के एपिसोड की शुरुआत में सबसे पहले हम नजर डालेंगे इंटेल ग्रैंड स्लैम चैंपियंस नावी के फ्रैग मूवी पर तो तैयार हो जाइए कुछ बहुत ही बेहतरीन फ्लिक शॉट्स और हेड शॉट देखने के लिए उसके बाद नजर डालेंगे बैटलफील्ड के एक बहुत ही ज्यादा आइकॉनिक ट्रिक शॉट पर भी जिसको डेवलपर्स ने भी ट्रिब्यूट दिया बैटलफील्ड ट्वेंटी फोर्टी टू के ट्रेलर के अंदर और देखेंगे उस ट्रिक शॉट के क्रिएटर का रिएक्शन आज के इंटरव्यू में एक बार फिर से बहुत इंटरेस्टिंग इंसान से हमारी बातचीत होने जा रही है तो उस इंटरव्यू की तरफ भी हम बढ़ेंगे एंड इन दी एंड आप सबको पता है क्या आने वाला है अ बंच ऑफ मीम्स सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी फर्दर टाइम दिस इज सुपर जॉनी एंड यू गाइस आर वाचिंग द वर्ल्ड ऑफ ई-स्पोर्ट्स इंटेल ग्रैंड स्लैम की एक्साइटमेंट एक बार फिर से बहुत बहुत ज्यादा एक्साइटिंग थी हमको नेल बाइटिंग मैचेस देखने को मिले बहुत ज्यादा क्लोज मैचअप्स भी हमको देखने को मिले बट एट दी एंड नावी ने इंटेल ग्रैंड स्लैम को अपने नाम किया और क्योंकि अब ई एस एल प्रो लीग सीजन फोर्टीन का टाइटल भी नावी जीत चुकी है तो एक फ्रैग मूवी तो बनती है लेट्स चेक इट आउट
dying. He doesn't know where they could be, but finally, he's actually got a timing on the dogs down. He's found another one. One at Banana, one Ruiz, but Spit has tapped the bomb again. Another headshot, it's just about misses out. Hats for the 4K. Bit that is just an end. Close shots takes the swing. Oh, a follow up out of electronic. Oh. And they'll close it out. A two on three and simple. is all it takes and there it is their domination is secured and i think their reaction says it all so much hard work pumped into this one intel grand slam in the bag aap mein se kai logon ne battlefield zarur kheli hogi agar nahi kheli ye dekhne ke baad aapka khelne ka mann zarur karega बेसिकली हुआ ये कि स्टन ग्रेवी जो 2011 में बैटलफील्ड थ्री खेल रहे थे उन्होंने एक ट्रिक शॉट किया जो काफी फेमस हुआ अपने जेट को लूप पर लगाकर उन्होंने खुद को इजेक्ट किया और हवा में ही एक ओपोनेंट को बजूका से उड़ा दिया एंड जैसे ही उनका प्लेन लेवल हुआ स्टन ग्रेवी वॉज बैक इन द जेट और इस शॉर्ट का नाम पड़ा रेंडेजूक एंड कट टू 2021 जब आता है बैटलफील्ड 2042 का ट्रेलर जिसमें ये ट्रिक शॉट को फीचर किया गया विच वॉज अ ग्रेट जेस्टर बाय द डेवलपर्स टू शो द लव टू दी ओजीज ऑफ द गेम स्टन ग्रेवी ने ये ट्रेलर का रिएक्शन भी दिया जिसमें वो काफी ज्यादा इमोशनल हमें नजर आए हाउ डू यू नो यू आर अ बैड एज गैंगस्टर अगर आपका कोई एक ट्रिक शॉट गेम के आने वाले ट्रेलर में फीचर हो Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, जैसा आपको मैंशन किया था दिस टाइम फॉर एन इंटरव्यू वी हैव समेरी स्पेशल बार आई हैव वेरी गुड फ्रेंड ऑफ माइंड 
on this show to talk about his experience with gaming and esports so please put your hands together for mohit mohit kaise bhai how are you doing i'm doing very good man how are you doing i'm doing good as well aur uh, mohit baat karne mein bahut maza aayega i mean kafi time se even though we are friends uh, catch up karne ka time nahi mila to i guess is opportunity ko waise bhi use kar sakte hain hum log uh, but i mean main to aapko acche se janta hu time to introduce yourself to the audience Uh, so hello everyone i am mohit manwani i'm a 22 year old psychology student currently pursuing applied psychology honors from uh, mumbai and uh, just it's been a great journey in esports so let's see how it goes <laughs> i mean just aapne mentioned ki it's been a great journey i guess uh, Uh, उस जर्नी के बारे में थोड़ा सा बताते तो चलिए वहीं से स्टार्टिंग से शुरू करते हैं बिल्कुल मेरा ये एक डिफॉल्ट क्वेश्चन होता है जो मैं अपने हर एक गेस्ट से पूछता हूँ हाउ डिड यू गेट इन टू गेमिंग सो आई हैव बीन इन गेमिंग फॉर क्वाइट अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम माय एल्डर ब्रदर इंट्रोड्यूस मी टू काउंटर स्ट्राइक आई गेस वन आई वॉज टेन ट्वेल्व ईयर्स ओल्ड सो स्टार्ट विद दैट लेटर ऑन मूव ऑन टू जी टी ए सीरीज एंड ऑल ऑफ दैट एंड आई थिंक इट वॉज मे और जून ट्वेंटी when uh, a friend of mine said hey let's just play pubg and i was like i i don't know not download the game just because everyone's playing it so i would play something you know which is not in the training but uh, because of peer pressure i had to download the game started playing <laughs> then i think it was season 2 back then like the game was still setting up the controls and everything yeah. everything in the game was still being introduced and i used to watch streamers like shroud uh, Choco Taco and all of that, all yeah. of them on stream. So I kind of knew the game already, so it was easy to grasp. But started playing casually, of course, like everyone else. And then uh, slowly, slowly, after I got better, 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 then the like mortal started streaming. Then I was yeah. introduced to three finger, four finger setups, <laughs> which was something actually revolutionary back then. And uh, then I just like I just played. I started playing because it was fun then I started playing because I knew I could win I was like in classics so I was winning obviously yeah and later on like people suggested that you should get into esports try competitive so I think it was 2019 that I started playing competitive uh uh through contacts I found this really great team and a clan called Vikings with them yeah. uh we were playing we in uh, eventually formed two teams then uh, vikings official and viking x so i was sort of like a player who used to play with both the teams so then we got into pmis which was i think my first official tournament pmis 2020 and uh, i played with uh, vikings official we got in the top 248 teams and yeah. uh, that was honestly quite an amazing journey and our other team viking x got into the semi finals of the same yeah. tournament so again as a whole clan as a whole family it was right quite a proud moment for us to you know like starting from devices like redmi note 5 and then coming to a level where even iphones aren't able to handle you know the game that was quite an amazing journey for me i guess I mean, it was an amazing journey for uh, uske baad things sort of completely changed uh, cuz Uh, colleges were about to start and you as you mentioned went into psychology to thoda sa time aapko wahan pe bhi dena pada but uh, as you said i mean chaliye isi background ke upar thodi baat karte hain like uh, ek psychological perspective se that like sports psychologist hote hain esports ke andar bhi yes but that is something that's very undermined in indian esports what do you have to say about that i think there is a definite need of more sports yeah. psychologist who actually consider esports as a sport and not yeah. a game like games are technically sports but esports should also be treated equally just like cricket football or something else and yeah. this also like people say that a sport is something in which we put our physical exertion to or physical energy to in this you are putting your mind's energy like yeah i i understand like pressing keys on keyboard or touching on mobile screen is not that physical as playing cricket but the mind is used mo- just like a chess game so i think a lot of sports psychologists are required in this field and definitely awareness regarding esports is still something which needs to be focused upon more in- especially in india 
आई एग्री विद दैट क्योंकि और आई थिंक उसका एक मेन रीजन ये भी होता है कि द पीपल दैट आर कंपीटिंग इन ई स्पोर्ट्स आर लॉट मोर यंग यू हैव दी सेवेंटीन ईयर ओल्ड सिक्सटीन ईयर ओल्ड्स जिनका वो मेंटल स्टेट इट्स स्टिल अंडर डेवलपमेंट एंड हैंडलिंग दैट सॉर्ट ऑफ प्रेशर वैन यू आर प्लेइंग फॉर अ लॉट ऑफ मनी ऑन द लाइन ऑन अ बिग स्टेज इट कैन बी नर्व ब्रेकिंग फॉर फॉर दीज यंग प्लेयर्स तो दैट इज़ समथिंग दैट नीड्स टू बी लुक डैट लेकिन चलिए अब कॉन्वर्सेशन को थोड़ा आगे बढ़ाते हैं एंड एज वी टॉक अबाउट इट यू स्टार्ट विद अ वेरी सॉर्ट ऑफ बेसिक बैकग्राउंड लाइक कमिंग फ्रॉम क्लासिक्स एक टीम ढूंढी कॉन्टैक्ट्स के थ्रू गॉट विद इन टच विद द प्लेयर स्टार्ट प्लेइंग मेड इट ऑल द वे टू पी एम आई एस एंड उस जर्नी के बारे में जानना चाहते लाइक हाउ डिड दैट सॉर्ट ऑफ कम टू इट्स इट्स स्टेजेस एज दे वेंट एंड अगर कोई नया प्लेयर स्टार्ट कर रहा है आज के टाइम पे अपनी जर्नी व्हाट एडवाइस वुड यू गिव सो अबाउट द जर्नी हाउ इट एक्चुअली हैपेंड थ्रू द पीएमएस सो वी जस्ट लाइक वी हैव बीन प्लेइंग क्लासिक्स फॉर अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम वी हैव बीन प्रैक्टिसिंग विद यू नो कस्टम स्क्रीम स्पेस टूर्नामेंट्स एंड ऑल ऑफ दैट सो वी वर स्टिल नॉट श्योर इफ यू वुड एक्चुअली गेट इनटू पीएमएस और नॉट सो आई रिमेंबर हाउ eagerly we were waiting for the emails like we were like email aaya email aaya like mid we were awake till 2 3 am and just refreshing our emails refreshing our emails checking ki did we get selected or not because the thing was we did you get qualified through classics we did play those yeah. we got a good average score average skill score and winning score but still there's a lot of uncertainty in this and it was just so overwhelming we were awake till 3 am then the other player was checking from 3 am to 7 8 am then we woke up then we started checking so it was a 24 hour cycle that was going on just checking email and i remember when we got the mail that you have been qualified it was just so overwhelming just like we were literally crying because of happiness and uh, it was a very you can say a proud moment for us because yeah all that hard work all that grind which started like a time pass was on its path to become a profession and that was i guess what kept us motivated and for anyone who's starting right now i would just say that focus on your building as a team and not just as a solo player yeah. because tournaments can be won by solo performances you need to develop as a team work for each other's differences and uh, there will be times when you think this team is better i should join this or that but for a while stick with the team there are obviously positives and negatives of each and every player work on those accordingly and i think if you develop as a team then you're definitely going to win yeah i mean kafi achhi advice hai that's good advice and this this is something we ha- even we had a conversation about this around i think a while back uh, when we were just getting to know each other and Uh, at that time i came to know a really interesting aspect of your life as well or that is that is why i wanted uh, you to be here because i wanted to show like all right gamers can do stuff outside that is like uh, contributing to the real world as well you used to rescue animals tell us something about that yeah so i think this started uh, late in 2016 or late 2017 i yeah Uh, started feeding the stray dogs in my colony and slowly slowly got attached to them adopted them slowly got them vaccinated got them neutered and everything and uh, now i have five dogs by the way it's a oreo brownie kuchu coffee and cookie and uh, after that i think after i adopted like oreo brownie after that i just felt sad for the strays how they have to search for a food each and every day everyone yeah. throwing stones at them they have been injured and nobody is treating them and i just wouldn't feel but help them and slowly slowly started started uh, working with a couple of ngos started uh, volunteering at a couple of local animal shelters in bhopal and uh, from there i just created this special bond with animals that i can i still do like no matter which animal it is where it is who it is i just go there connect with them and that that just gives me happiness i mean khushi to aapko hoti hai lekin watching this like it, it is very heartwarming like the stuff that you do and it i i believe what also motivated me earlier on to uh, sort of try and do my best to feed if i can uh, the local strays that I, we had uh, at our place as well it was it was a nice thing i mean whatever little we can do 
we have to do to contribute and give back to the world. Uh, but Mohit, this is like uh, again one last piece of advice if you want to give to the people. This is just the gamers, not even advice to make it pro. Just the gamers or the human beings that are watching this show. Um, one general advice that I would yeah. give to all the gamers out there is, don't uh, just focus on gaming, but don't just focus on one thing either. You sh yeah. should uh, definitely keep gaming as a choice, but don't make it the only choice and do things outside the world go out like you can't go because of covid restrictions i understand but <laughs> at least go out of your own room go to the living room <laughs> take around talk to your friends talk to your family spend time with nature spend time with everything in general and that's how you maintain a good gaming life as well if you aren't doing well psychologically you aren't going to yeah. perform well in your games exactly i mean mental state ka khayal rakhna kaafi important ho jata hai if you want to do well warna burn out ho jata hai logo ko but again that 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 is also something uh, i mean uh, quite important you need to keep in mind go out go to the living room talk to your family talk to your friends phone pe baat karo cuz gaming bhi i mean at the end uh, is i mean more about uh, as as well jitna competing ke bare mein it's about socializing as well and like playing with other people that's why there is a solo queue that's why there is a ladder jahan pe aap randoms ke sath khelte ho <laughs> Uh, but Mohit, it has been a pleasure talking to you. Thank you so much for giving us your time, uh, and we'll we'll meet again soon. Definitely, man. It's been an honor being here. Thank you so much for the opportunity. और मीम से ज़्यादा आई डोंट थिंक कोई चीज़ आपका दिन अच्छा बना सकती है तो मीम्स की तरफ बढ़ते हैं एंड आई गेस वीकेंड आ चुका है और हम सब गेमर्स को पता है हम इस वीकेंड क्या करने वाले हैं और ये बात तो हम सबको पता है कि नॉर्मल लोग और गेमर्स चीजों को अलग नजरिए से देखते हैं लेकिन पैराशूट्स के मामले में विजन डिफरेंस कुछ इस तरह का होता है और एक बात तो हम सबको पता है व्हाट गोज अप मस्ट कम डाउन ये बात रैंक लैडर पे भी अप्लाई होती है तो आज के लिए बस इतना ही मैं आप लोगों से फिर मिलूंगा हमारे अगले एपिसोड में तब तक के लिए थैंक यू सो मच फॉर ट्यूनिंग एंड अंटिल नेक्स्ट टाइम टेक केयर बाय बाय